All right, so to figure out just how powerful these rockets are and whether or not these Kevlar pants are actually going to save my legs, we're going to do a quick test to see if the the rocket plume will actually eat through the Kevlar or not. So, so it's not plugged in? No. Nope. All right, so we have the ignition wires set up. I'm just going to put on my welding gloves and welding mask. And we'll get ready to test this Kevlar. Alright, Ryan. Three, two, one. Two, one. Kevlar pants are not going to cut it. <coughs> Alright, so the uh, Kevlar is just not going to cut it. It absolutely got incinerated. And this was actually two layers of Kevlar. And as you can see, it burned the wood pretty good. So, if we're going to make pants to actually withstand this kind of rocket blast, we're going to need some kind of either metal or wood insert as well, which is going to be tricky because if I'm flying up 10 feet in the air, I don't want to have bulky pants because when I come back down and land, it's not going to be fun. So, I might have to go back to the drawing board for this one. Hey guys, hope you enjoyed that video. It's a small section from our ongoing Iron Man flight project, which we're doing exclusively on Maker Amino, our main sponsor for this project. To see more about it, you're going to have to check out their app. Maker Amino is a mobile app community for sharing everything Maker. You can share your projects, ask for feedback, and more. We're using it to document my rocket flight project. So far, we've done about four videos, and it's going pretty well. We gotta admit, the rockets are a bit scarier than we thought they were, but I'm super excited to do our big test flight. In fact, we just finished the weldment for um, holding the rockets to my body. Anyway, the app's really cool, and it's, it's a great little community. You can discover other users, um, and they have other categories too. So if you want to find me, download the app from the App Store and search Hacksmith. That might have been the problem from the first one.